Hey guys, I'm Henry. I'm Ian. And we are Bosch. Bosch. And today we're making you one of our veganuary recipes for a week's worth of seasonal, delicious, and simple eating. It's a roast vegetable and chickpea korma. It's gorgeous, and it should be really, really quick for you to cook. We've cut out loads of steps, and if you've done your prep in advance, it's gonna be even quicker. We've got over here some roasted root vegetables, all of which are seasonal, and we roasted them for about 30 minutes with a little bit of oil and some salt and a sprinkle of cayenne pepper. So like any good curry, it starts with an onion. While he's doing that, I'm gonna get this rice on the bubble. We've got 150 grams of brown rice. We want a really big, generous pinch of salt. Now bring that to a boil and then simmer it for about 25 minutes. How's that chopping going? Coming along nicely. We're quick cooking here, so I'm gonna get some cashews and just give them a quick boil. If you've got a really fast blender, like a Nutribullet, you don't need to boil them, but boiling them just softens them a little bit. So with these onions, we are frying them away. We're gonna soften them up. We're gonna release all those wonderful natural sugars that are inside. Perfect, now these are, well, as good as they could be. Now what we're gonna do here is just go in with all of our spices immediately. Three garlic cloves, two tablespoons of ginger, a pinch of both turmeric and ground nutmeg, half a teaspoon of cayenne pepper, two cinnamon sticks, five cardamom pods, which we broke with the back of a knife, and that's it, we're keeping it really simple. Already smells like a korma. Next up, we're gonna make a cashew cream. We've let our cashews just cool down a little bit because you don't wanna be pouring boiling water in there. And then we're just gonna add both the cashews and the water they've been soaking in to a Nutribullet. 60 grams of cashews and a little bit of water as well. Exactly, about five tablespoons of water. And then we're just gonna whiz. There we go, we now have a cashew cream. Perfect for a korma. Oh, it looks really, really smooth, doesn't that? Next up, we're gonna take that off the heat and add our plant-based yogurt. So this is coconut yogurt, which is gonna add a gorgeous flavor. And the reason we took it off the heat is that sometimes coconut yogurt, if it's heated too quickly, could split. And we just wanna stir it through nicely, get everything well incorporated before putting it back on the heat. Roasted root vegetables here. This is kind of what we mean when we say eating the rainbow. Perfect. That looks great. Next, we're gonna add one tin of chickpeas, high in fiber and packed full of protein. We could probably add a little bit of water to loosen. Like the idea of that, that's definitely good. This is looking like edging towards done, huh? Yeah. But it needs one more secret ingredient. It's green, it's leafy, it's spinach. Spinach. So this stuff is packed with goodness. And if you're doing veganuary or on a plant-based diet, you really want to get a lot of green veg. That's why we do shortcuts like this. So it's about 130 grams. Now that spinach has wilted away and the consistency is perfect. We'll just have a quick taste. Oh, I like that. Mm, that's really delicious, tasty. right? Yeah. That it's is genuinely very, very, very good. So good. I think it needs a little bit more salt. Just a wee touch. And it's a fairly punchy korma. It's got a bit of spice. So if you don't like it spicy, you could reduce that spice. I mean, that's taken us about 20 minutes. Really quick, and the main reason it was quick is because we already roasted those veggies. And it's packed, packed full of everything that you need to have a really successful, healthy veganuary. And beyond. And beyond, exactly. So this will serve two people, um, or it will serve one person with leftovers, like if you're doing our veganuary meal plan. Lovely, tasty korma with fantastically, perfectly cooked rice. We're gonna have one for a meal right now, and we're gonna save a little bit for leftovers tomorrow. This is gonna be a really tasty lunch at work the next day. I think everyone will be super jealous. You might stink them out a little bit having a curry for lunch, but you know what? I don't care about that. Yeah, curry for lunch is... It's a good thing. It's a win. Right, right so we have a taste of this then. I think it'd be rude not to. Can't wait, let's get involved. Wow. Really delicious. That is a perfect korma. It's quick, it's seasonal, it's tasty, and it was, you know, 20 or so minutes. And it's very, very healthy. And we've got loads more recipes just like this one coming your way very soon, so be sure to subscribe. And if you like this video, hit like, and please let us know what you thought in the comments. One more thing, guys, we've also made a week's worth of recipes, which includes this one, to help you eat the rainbow for a week. The PDF that we've made is in the description below, and it's going to help you nail veganuary. And it's got a shopping list, it's got a prep list, and it's gonna make you incredibly healthy for a week. And it's free. And that's it. Bish. Bash. Bosh. Bosh.